Okay, welcome today. Um, something completely new um, for me. Uh, we have uh, my uh, old phone, the 4S, iPhone 4S, and my new phone, iPhone 5. So I just want to uh, show you quickly how they actually um, got shipped. Uh, quick unboxing of both um, and um, quick startup just to see how they look like, size comparison. Okay, so let's just go uh, right into it. Okay, so let's just compare the, the boxes. Uh, as you can see, the iPhone 4S came in white, the iPhone 4, uh, sorry, 5 coming uh, in a black one. Though I'm not quite sure if this is the same with the white edition. Uh, this one, obviously, the black uh, version. As you can see, the boxes, um, the white one is a bit taller. Um, however, it's shorter, right? So let me see if I can point it up for you. Here we go. So it is shorter. Obviously, the iPhone 5 is slimmer and taller, so therefore, it, I guess, it reflects in the boxes. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, iPhone 4S. This one is the 32 GB. Uh, for the 5, I went for the 64 GB. And uh, let's just see how they basically arrive. Okay, I'll open up both. So here we go. Um, both black. Uh, this one still has the one from the shipping. This one has. Uh, um, sticker on it to protect it, same for the back um, and as you can see already if you compare them both <coughs> um, you can see the 4S is slightly thicker however uh, what I really like about the 4S is that it came with a silver side which uh, the 5 doesn't have uh, you can see the buttons um, pretty much the same Okay, so I focus is pretty much the same. This one is a little bit taller and slimmer. Um, what else on that side? Uh, there's a SIM card slot, and you can see as well from the size. Uh, one is a micro, one is a nano SIM. Um, from my operate, uh, operator, uh, I got this kind of... Um, I don't know how to call this. Uh, basically, to, ma to make the SIM card in the iPhone 5 fit in the 4S uh, and to fit in the regular phones, which is quite a nice feature. Um, then what do we have from the bottom? Uh, as you can see here, we have the new uh, pin for charging and data transfer in the 5 versus the 4. And we have uh, the speakers actually are bigger in the 5. You can see it's a bit small on the left and a bit big on the right, uh, while here the stereo mics are small. On uh, top we have the on and off button and what I actually don't like is that uh, on the 5 you have uh, the the headphone jack is not on top like on the 4S uh, it's on the bottom which is kind of stupid if you have uh, a certain pouch or a certain um, you know thing to put the phone in. Um, okay just put them on the side so let's see what came in the 4 and of course it's the 5 uh, box. So we take this out we have obviously all this uh, blah 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 in the middle uh, right below and then we have here this is the UAE adapter if you're wondering uh, I'm living in Dubai so this is how they come here and this was obviously the USB cable <coughs> and here we have the headphones these are the old headphones from the 4S as you can see with the uh, loud and uh, quiet button oh, sorry the volume button here we have the new um, iPhone 5 headphones uh, which they look a bit more funky and then you have the USB cable well, same thing that would be over here basically uh, however the um, it's a lighting adapter so this is a smaller a smaller connector right so let's put this back and um, we close this one up <coughs> so if we start them both up you will see uh, the size of the display obviously um, much bigger on the 5 as you can see here it's one line bigger and uh, it's more crisp so obviously this one uh, the, the plastic I have on top to protect the screen it's a bit of weird it, it takes the colors off let me just take the plastic off from this one and from the back as well Okay, and as you can see here, um, while the 4S came with a black um, bag with the silver Apple logo, and the 5 uh, comes with this kind of metal, I don't know what you call this, metal design. 
uh, and you have the bottom and top is shiny and the back side is kind of brushed uh, which is kind of the same as on the side front is all pretty much screen you have the home button uh, you have the um, camera and the mic sorry the, the ear speaker uh, earphone and um, yeah I mean the display is really really brilliant I don't know if you can see it versus the 4S uh, I think you can see a difference and um, I, uh, what I really like is that this one is so much lighter than the 4S you know despite it being a bit taller and longer uh, it is slimmer uh, but so much lighter um, which is really really nice um, however uh, one thing that I really really am disappointed uh, which I'm not which I don't know from Apple is uh, if you really look at the phone when it got shipped it had already a few problems with scratches so let me see if you can see um, do you see them here right above my finger let me see if I can point it out to you it's right there this one and this one see this uh, I'm sorry this and this it's a two line tiny little scratches it came like this when I actually took it out of the box uh, I didn't use the phone before and uh, it's kind of shouldn't shouldn't happen okay so um, and like for both phones I don't only protect them with the um, with the plastic on top uh, I have covers for them so let me show you the covers for them as well okay so um, I am a huge Mont Blanc fan, as you can see, maybe I'm going to show you a few more videos uh, of uh, what I have in my collection. Um, when I bought the 4S I didn't have a cover and I didn't want to keep it like this uh, or have some bulky shit around it. So I bought this one which comes from Mont Blanc. And this one was actually made for the Blackberry, uh, the typical Blackberry with a keyboard. However it fits uh, the iPhone 4S. Um, okay, it didn't um, really go until the top. Uh, due to it not being made for the iPhone um, but I really liked it, uh, it it was kind of loose I mean you can see it's kind of falling out if you if you don't put it, point it downwards um, but uh, it kind of worked for me and uh, as I was really happy with this one I got uh, the actual iPhone 5 case for my new phone and as you can see again it's from Mont Blanc and when you put that one inside it actually exactly on the top so you can see it, uh, it finishes where the phone finishes which is nice and uh, no you cannot record with it well, you, you can use a flashlight if you want to uh, but again it's not made for that and it's just for protection and it looks very beautiful it's uh, it's very classy uh, obviously leather both are leather and um, if you're interested to buy this cover it's uh, in UE it costs 815 dirhams which is approximately an uh, euro, 160 euro, something like this. And this one was a bit cheaper, it was 765, so well, not 10 euro less, uh, so 150 euro. Um, and uh, you can see the iPhone 5 much slimmer, obviously with the case as well being for the iPhone 5. And um, yeah, very nice. So if you want to know more, uh, let me know. And I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick review and unboxing. Thank you very much. Cheers.